Hello friends, it's Dogs here and today I'm gonna be ranking all the knives in Valorant. I mean almost all the knives. Because some of them are just battle pass, uh, too boring, uh, too ugly, knives too basic, no animations, nothing going on much for them. So I just put them under the F tier. And if you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing, liking, sharing with your family, with your friends, with your dogs and pets and the MILF neighbor. Right. Starting off with the Altitude Knuckle Knife. Um, this knife has a cool um, heavy attack animation, but it just it, it got nothing going on for it. So I'm just gonna place it in D tier. Nothing, nothing crazy. Nothing like it looks nice, but it has nothing to it. Arax's Fist Knife. I mean, it's kind of cool, I guess. It has a cool sound. It looks cool, but I'm not the biggest. Uh, of like uh, the biggest fan of these fist knuckle knives so i'm gonna place it in s tier and go into the oni sword which is a complete s tier the animations the look of it oh my god it's just too clean the variants all the variants are nice literally all of them are nice and i think white one the white one is my favorite one it's just like a very unique sword and I wish Riot Games put more effort into the other swords. I'm not gonna lie, this sword is just, again, like, like it looks nice but it has nothing going on for it. So it's just C tier. And then the Chaos Blade. Chaos Blade is, um, is a disaster. It looks cool, the idea of it is cool. It takes half of your screen, and that's pretty much it. And then the black market butterfly. This butterfly is very nice. I think this butterfly is A tier and, and maybe A tier. Mm, I'm gonna put it in A tier for now. I might change my mind and put it in S tier, but for now it's gonna stay in A tier. And now the blade of circuit. The pull up animation is nice. The attack animation I, I like the third attack animation when he attacks with both and this like heavy attack is kind of cool too it's just like other other knives are kind of nicer that's that's pretty much it so it's like for me it, it would be like and now the blades of imperium i mean they're kind of nice i like i like the inspect animation they're cool i think the variants are cool too yeah, the variants look nice. I'm gonna put this in B tier. The Goofy and Knife. This knife is like kinda cool. I don't know, like the pull up animation is cool. I don't know, like it's not that crazy. I guess if you're like a memer guy, you, you can use this and it'll be like cool for you. But it's nothing like serious. So I'm gonna put it in C. And now Blade of the Rune King. This is one of the swords that's kind of a kind of a mess. Like, like I like it, but I don't at the same time. Like, why all the long swords have the same hold animation? Like, why? Like, why they cannot be like the only sword? You know what I mean? Like, why cannot they be unique? I don't know. It's just it looks cool. It sounds cool, but the holding animation just not that good. I don't know. It's another B tier for me. Because it's a little bit better than the Chaos Blade. And then the Katrina. Katrina is just like a... Like a, a C tier, I guess. The Chromodic Gauntlet is like a, Another C tier. I'm not the biggest fan of fist knives, like I said before. Like, they're cool. But... I don't know, I just don't like them that much. And then the Reinhardt Goofy Air Hammer. I mean, let's be honest, bro. It's an F tier. Crimstone Beast Hammer. The Crimstone Beast Hammer looks cool. Nothing too crazy. It's just like a, another mid knife or hammer, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Just too basic. Nothing too crazy on an inspect. So it's another C tier for me. Elder Flame Dagger. Like it's nothing, nothing too crazy. So it's another C tier. Mid mid knife. 
I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how to pronounce the name of this fucking fan knife. I'm just, I mean, it looks kinda cool. It's a B for me. I mean, the inspect animation is kinda clean. When, uh, the pull up is clean, I mean. Yeah. The Forsaken Dagger, another B tier. The Champion's Karambit, S tier. There is no argument. Nothing, nothing much to say about the champions karambit i mean we all know the champions butterfly knife another s tier the kunai i'm gonna put this here and i know i might get some hate on this because it's not an s tier some people say all the champions knives are like s tier but i think the kunai is an a the ego knife ego knife d tier the Gaia Axe and the Gaia Dagger or Knife, whatever the fuck you want to call it. They both go here next to each other like the twins they meant for each other. The Glitch Pop Dagger. I'm put it on B tier. These are not organized by the way, but I'm, I'm gonna organize them when I finish. The Deldo Goofy A uh, Sword or Blade, whatever the fuck you want to call it. If you want to use this for memes, sure, but again, like, this is only like meme, meme, like, knife. The Iron Blade, this one, another D, e, I mean, it's not even C. Some people would put it here, some people like it too much to here. But another best type of knife that I'm not the biggest fan of, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it in D e tier. The Iron Karambe, Iron Karambe is an A for me honestly it might be an s yeah honestly it's an s the celestial fan celestial fan is an b the ignite fan is an s and i know some people would put it in a and maybe b but for me it's an s like holy and it has this variant too which is nice too so yeah this is an s tier the K Tech Blade. The K Tech Blade is a, a rip off, a knockoff RGX blade. So I'm gonna put it in. Yeah, it's just so basic. It's a D tier. The Kurunami. Ooh. I cannot decide if this one is an S or A. I'm actually putting an S just because it's very, very unique. It's just nice. Like the animations, everything about it is nice. The pull up animation, everything. I don't even know what's the name of this, but too basic, too boring. Boom. The Lux knife, I mean, bro, come on now. Mage Punk Fist Knife. Yeah, that's a, a C. In Mage Punk Butterfly Knife, uh, I think it's a B for me. Mm, maybe actually an A. Is that an A? Yeah, it's an A. The Default Knife. Default Knife is actually not that bad. Put it in, in D tier. Frontier Axe. I actually like this axe. I ac actually like it a lot. The only axe that I actually really like. So yeah, I'm gonna put it in A tier. The Neptune Axe is B, C tier. Popsy. The Goofy Bat Skin. This shit is C tier. Another too basic. No, nothing about it. D tier. Claw. Oni Claw. Uh, only claw is like the only decent claw fist skin it's b tier the origin played i mean this shit is like b at most i don't know maybe even c i'll put it in b the overdrive blade is an a the talking weird robot knife this this knife is very overhyped this this is like top C. Actually bottom C. It, it looks kinda odd, like I don't know. I don't like it. The power fist. Very overpriced, overrated skin. Another C. The prime karambit. Prime karambit could be A. Prime axe. Prime axe is 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 B. A basic axe. Basic axe is C maybe 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 bottoms B but there is still some difference here the prosperity blade and dagger 
This is another mid skin. I'm not gonna lie. See, hey, another goofy bat skin. I mean, if you're using it for the memes again, if you want to be funny, sure. But other than that, it's C at most. So I'll put it bottom C. The Reaver Karambit. Yeah. And of course, it's Reaver Dagger. A. The Raycon Butterfly Knife. This is another A. The Sentinel Blade slash Sword Shit. Another C. Actually, it could be B, actually. Not that bad. Another Sentinel. I mean, I like these more, but they're not they're not worthy of to be like A tier. They're B at most. The RGX Blade is an A. The RGX Butterfly Knife is an S. The Ruined Dagger, I'm actually gonna put this one in B tier. I like how it looks. I know the animation is simple and it, it's like the same other daggers. Like this one for example. But I don't like how this one looks. I like how this one looks though. It's more about the looks. The Monkey Staff. Monkey Staff is an A. The Singularity Knife. I'm actually gonna put it in C, so it's not that bad. Smite Knife. It's just the Smite Knife. Put it in C tier. The Snow Wand. Snow Wand is a D, C, 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 sure, C. The Scythe. Scythe. I feel like this Scythe had so much potential, and they just made it so basic, and it's just C tier. Like this scythe could have been so much cooler. Imagine imagine just a longer scythe with like a very unique animation to it. Like it's just like a different type of animation. They would have probably made a bank with this if they if they just worked hard on it. They just made a like a fucking two inch scythe that has nothing. It just like glows and it has like a very weird thing going on for it. This shit, I don't even know what's the name for it. I'm just gonna put it in F tier, honestly. Too too ugly, hideous. The Terminus Fist. I actually, I don't mind this one. Mm, sure, B tier. The Titan Male Mage. I mean, look at this shit, bro. Like, it's just so weird. Like, like I think, like, it looks cool, but it doesn't have anything. No inspect cool animation, nothing. But this is just a straight F tier because they had a lot of potential with it. And they just made it basic. Another, actually, I'm gonna bring the Scythe and D just for the same reason. Like, it could have been so cooler, could have been so much cooler, and just made it basic. The Jet Konami knife. What is this, bro? No, don't use this, please. The VCT lock in knife. This might be an S tier, actually. I'm not gonna lie, this is an S tier for me. Velocity cramp. This is an A tier. Uh, any karambit is at least an A tier just because it's a karambit. Uh, I don't even know what's the name of this, but I think it's very simple and doesn't have anything. The waveform blade, A tier. The candy can, it's mostly at D. The Xeno hunter is an S tier, and I don't, I don't care what the fuck anyone says. This Yoro butterfly knife, it's a butterfly, so I have to put it above D. But well, it's mostly at sea just because how it looks and it has Yoro on it. The Zero Fan knife. I mean, bro, this knife is just so clean and so good. It's it's a mix of the Koronami, the Xeno Hunter, the weird robot knife that I rated down there. But bro, it's like they had all of them had a threesome, like Xeno Hunter, Koronami, and this thing. And they made this and it's just so good and it's just an S tier. Alright guys, this is the final ranking of the knives in order in my opinion. Tell me what you think in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, like and if you didn't dislike. And subscribe and share. I'm out of here. Peace.